With Gardercore Centra, you can quickly and easily begin to understand how workloads and applications communicate within your environment. Here we're looking at our reveal map. And let's say I wanted to see how uh, applications in our production environment are communicating. I can easily drill in and get a visual representation of how these applications communicate with the rest of the environment. And I can understand, for example, how my Swift application communicates with different parts of the infrastructure. I can also understand how the individual components of the Swift application communicate with themselves and with different parts of the infrastructure to see how these tiers actually function in my environment. I can understand how the web servers connect into the database servers all the way down to understanding that when the web servers connect in, they connect to the Mongo daemon running on the database server. I also have some information about additional context about that process so you can understand what it is and how it functions in the environment. This gives you the right level of context to make informed decisions about your segmentation policies before you put them in place so you can have confidence that the rule you're putting in place will not impact a business uh, process within your environment. When it comes to putting rules in place, you have two options. The first option is putting in a deny rule. This is a rule that excludes traffic within the environment and can easily be written using an override block rule. This rule, for example, will say something like anything classified as a database server should be blocked and prevented from connecting directly to the internet. This rule gets applied globally to anything we've classified as a database server and will prevent different types of data exfiltration uh, from uh, attackers trying to move data outside of your environment. The other option for creating rules is to uh, use a, a true micro-segmentation approach and take the visual representation of what we see for here for our CMDB application and begin building policy off of what we understand is happening in the environment. You can quickly move into a policy builder and ask Gardacore for different types of policies to secure your application. And then you can analyze the connections to determine if they should be allowed to access the CMDB application. So I can look here and say, you know what, this jump box should be allowed to connect to the CMDB over port 80. I'm going to head, go ahead and allow this connection. Gardacore writes the rule for you based on our analysis and understanding of the connection all the way down to the actual applications that are involved. From here, your decision is what to do with everything else. We allow you to begin in an alert mode so you can monitor and tune policies while they are implemented to ensure that you're addressing uh, future connections that you may not have seen before. And once you're ready to move to block, you can go ahead and shift this rule down from alert to block. Now that we publish our policy, it gets implemented down to the Gardacore agent and the enforcement of this policy will begin as soon as that's applied. Uh, this is how simple it is with Gardacore Centra to visualize your environment, understand the dependencies of an application, and create policy within the system.